Fly. <laughs> For many years, many of you remember, Kodak was the official sponsor of Balloon Fiesta. Now, that, of course, was back when most people still used film cameras. And the only way to share your photos was to break out a photo album. KOB's Elizabeth Reed talked to one photographer about how things have changed. Not long ago, people watched the balloon fiesta like this. Eyes to the skies, with cameras snapping here and there because film went fast. But now, thanks to social media, we're all looking at balloons behind a screen and sharing them in seconds. And it's not just millennials joining in on the movement. I bet they can better pictures. Yeah, I'll go back and share them with my mother and my son. It's the easiest way to share it with people. We can upload them onto social media right away. But are we missing out on the experience because we're too busy playing with our phones? Let me just take a picture. Dr. Regina Valencia is one fiesta goer who remembers simpler times. Back then it was film and then you had to wait for those pictures to become developed. Wonderful memories for us but we hardly ever look at them anymore. But now they're sitting in shoe boxes in my attic. Now she looks forward to watching her photos entertain others for years to come. And you just hear people say, I could have never imagined this, what it looks like in real life. And, and they're sharing it with their friends. And with more than 19,000 Balloon Fiesta photos uploaded on Instagram, the whole world can now see it in ways they never could before. Elizabeth Reed, KOB Eyewitness News 4. I kind of like the old photos. There's a new contest this year for all of you smartphone and iPad fanatics. It's called the Balloon Fiesta Shot List. To enter, just tag any photos or videos you take with the hashtag Balloon Fiesta. They can be posted on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Vine, or YouTube. Balloon Fiesta organizers will pick a winning photo and video every day. Winners will get exclusive balloon.